Yo, what's up guys? It's really here and welcome to my channel. And today we know we had to showcase the baddie, one of my favorites, and that is Rock and Rock DN. You already know. Shotty a little baddie. Yes, sir. But she pretty much is like a Margaret counter. Um, she's coming to global for um the Rock and Rock banner. That's when y'all you guys are gonna get Super Wakening 6. And you also get the demonic beast battle as well. Pretty hard to get the holy war relics. Um, pretty much she just removes buffs whenever she attacks um depending on how many buffs the buffs or debuffs they have so if they have like um three buffs then she'll increase the damage dealt by 40 percent per buff so that'd be equal to 120 percent that's the maximum amount so it's pretty nice um her ultimate also can remove buffs as well which is pretty decent because she does at six out of six increase her damage dealt to all allies by 42 percent so she's pretty much gonna one shot you if she ever ults um, a Margaret team. Um, we also gonna be using um, Kyo to apply the, the buffs, well, not buffs, debuffs on them. Then we got Margaret, you know, just for the cleanse, and Chandler just to troll other Margaret players as well. Also protect my DN. I'm just gonna try to rush DN ultimate most of the time, just to nuke everybody, honestly. All right, what we got? Ooh, a Perkse Bond team. This might be pretty decent for us. Is that? Oh, that's Sobo Meliodas. Yeah, he's definitely trying to um go for his ultimate so you know what i can do to this guy i'm just gonna rush my ultimate on the end on him for the most part um actually let's see how much damage i can do with this with this card let's see pow look at that that's a good chunk Thirty thousand damage now remember we, got, we are able to cleanse um which is decent for us perfect state bond look like you're going for his buffs He's going for his stack cards. Wait, if he goes for Margaret right here with his rank up, he's done for. Honestly. Oh, wait. I just thought about it. Hmm. Actually, wait. What am I worried about? Yeah, like, what am I worried about? Like, if she tried to cleanse or anything like that, she's done for. Anyways. So that's still good for us. So we're going to move our buffs again. And we also got our ultimate ready. I actually want to see him do it. Look at all that damage we are doing to this guy. Because he keeps throwing up buffs to himself. I was thinking about trying to debuff him like cons consistently with like Chandler. But I was like, uh, I want him to have them buffs up. And he goes for his Meliodas ultimate as well. Oh yeah, boys. This is going to be some nice damage. All right, y'all ready? Tell you man, this is how it this is how it works out all the time. And we go throw up our stance as well. I think this is instant one shot. See ya. Bow. Told you boys, instant one shot. Like you really can't stop the ultimate at all. <laughs> GG though. Alright, what we got? What we got? Uh a droll. How do you oh CC me? Oh my god. This is why I need a level. I mean not a level. Uh SA waking some units. This is disrespectful. But at least he's going to be less hesitant on his gold buffs. Obviously, he's going to try it, but that's all right. We, we big brain anyways over here. It doesn't matter what he does because we can remove buffs on his droll regardless. He just did that just to waste some cards. Oh, my God. He got a petrification. Holy. Oh, that's not a good sign. Um, yeah, that's not a good sign for me. He's definitely gonna save his petrification then. It's all right. We're gonna get another cleanse. All right. You got sometimes you got trust in the harder cards. You feel me? And the end can rule buff. So even if he um does anything, it's all right. Ooh, we probably gonna have our ultimate soon as well. Going for the one asking cards as well. I'm not liking this no stance and no um. I don't know why he wastes his cards like that. Alright. Alright, I'm just gonna move his buffs right here. Um I'm just do this. And probably go from ultimate. So do this. Boom, boom. Boom. Oh, dang. 
I forgot the debuffs counts first. I should have just attacked. I forgot the debuffs counts first. Instead of this taunt. It's about the oldest um debuff or buff. So he's gonna probably try to cleanse right here. Oh wait, did he even try to petrify me? I guess it doesn't matter because I got a buff. Well, let's see what happens. He's he's pretty he's pretty guaranteed like getting nuked. Unless his Eskimo somehow one shot me with a channel up. All right, that, that was cute. Unless he one shots me right here. And he does not. So this is going to be instant death for him. Because he got all them buffs on himself. All right, well, GG, boys. That's what I'm saying. Like, this combination is just disgusting. See ya. Removed all his buffs. And we're doing more damage. Boom. Instant death. Sometimes you got to love 4v4 sometimes. And there goes the baddie. But, oh, we got a goddess team. Definitely abusing them, boys. Yo, tell me why, like, what was it, like, Wednesday? I had the best sleep of my life. I swear. Um, He's probably going to just go for mad cleanses, so. Uh, we we just going to do this to him. We're going to move my card. That's all I try to do is just go for ultimate anyways. He's going to go for a cleanse. probably attacking with, um, sorry, yo. Right here. Good thing I'm using Chandler so I can decrease his stats, stats real quick. But yeah, I had like the best sleep of my life. Like, you know, I just had to take some of that, you know, that NyQuil. I, that stuff put me, had me super drowsy. Like that sleep was like amazing. Yeah, you better be careful, my guy. How about I say, you better attack. You don't want me to you know, do some damage or something. He's probably waiting to like, this man damn is garbage. I mean, he does know either way. He's still getting nukes. Even if he throws out buffs on himself. He knows that, right? But I don't know. Like, that, that just made me, like, get... It was just a good, well-rested sleep. You feel me? And I loved it. Okay, he wastes his card and he got hit with a counter. I don't know why. And he does that to himself. So he's definitely about to get punished right now. Uh, thank you for the damage then, my guy. Appreciate it. Um, what did I go for? It's you. And let's guarantee that you're deaf. But yeah, like, it just, well, like, for me, it takes a good minute to like for go to sleep you know because you know i'll be having like work and stuff so it takes a it takes a while oh my god I just realized i'm gonna cleanse my own stuff what, what what kind of logic is this like it just takes a while for me to go to sleep especially since i'd be so energized from like you know doing videos and stuff even if he buffs up i could just kill off his sorry yo. or stall him out by just debuffing him so it's all it's all up to him. Like you ever have that moment where you just can't go to sleep? Like I had so many friends who like told me all about how they couldn't go to sleep. So they had to do certain things. Like they had to do weed or take some NyQuil. And I just did that. Like I just did it for once. Cause I was just like, I just needed some sleep. You feel me? And it, it felt amazing. I'm not gonna lie. Like that was the best sleep I ever had. That's why I haven't really been uploading as much because Literally, I just been so tired working and stuff. But let's go to the next one. All right, let's see what we got. Um, Assault Mode Melio team with Zeldris. My favorite. At least it ain't the Green Day area one. That one is absolutely annoying. <laughs> I kid you not. That one is terrible. The face. Um. I don't know. Should I just spam my attack cards on them? Oh, wait. I mean, I can move cards on them as well. Um, we can debuff. Hopefully, we get um another DN card. That'd be nice, right? Oh, uh, we get another cleanse, which also is really good, especially since he's using the Zeldris team, which really requires him to debuff us. Oh, uh, he's gonna target Margaret. 
Yep. He, he's a Margaret hater. I'm sorry. Which is also pretty good for me again. Like, if I'm using Margaret and I have Deanne, I can just move cards on him, just nuke him afterwards. Unless he somehow gets his ultimate. That will be a pain. But. Hmm. Actually, wait. Let's do this. Uh, I'm going to say attack, but I don't really have nothing. Let's just do this. Let's just do this for now. I don't want to lose my DN. Giving myself mad debuffs. The most he can do is probably go for his ultimate on Meliodas. And if he doesn't, he just gets nuked. Yeah. Like I, like I figured, he's gonna probably just gonna get himself nuked afterwards. If he didn't go for it. Um, he's using double counters, which is always easy to counter. All you have to do is just rush ultimate on him. Like I said before, the only team that I really struggle with is the green dairy area one. Because I'm forced to attack. But with this team, it's just easy Ws. Especially since he got himself um, immunity buff himself right now. Zelda's just gonna have to debuff me. Yo. If he's gonna debuff me with Chandler, it better be two times. This better be twice. Or he's in some trouble. Yep, bye bye. It's already too late. It's it's I'm guar it's guaranteed, my guy. It's already too late. I, I'm, I'm gonna tell you right now, it's already too late. Um, I could probably just do this and just have Kyo just finish you off. If this doesn't just wipe you out, I'm pretty sure it's gonna just one shot. Yeah, it's just gonna guarantee one shot, people. That's how strong our ultimate is. Yep, clean up that mess. All right, so we got a Zeldris player with Droll. All right. I guess it's easy money. He has multiple units can take away my gauge though. I don't like that. Um. <laughs> yeah, I don't really like this. All right, I'm just do this and try to go from ultimate on him. All right, let's waste this card. I don't know. I just like wasting that card. Maybe I might get just in case I get lucky with a merge like that. Did you never know you might get lucky sometimes. Those of droll on nice stuff for him. Um, probably do something like this then. And I don't know if it's going to hit him. Um, it's only if it gets rid of that taunt, though. Let's see. Nice, it does. So we cleanse. And if I got another cleanse, it's pretty much GG then. Oh my god, I didn't get rid of the taunt. I knew it. It's because the Ignites came out first. Yeah, he's definitely going to cleanse that away. Wait, he doesn't... Oh. Does he have a silver with Zeldris? That'd be kind of weird. Because he doesn't kill me with Zeldris. Yep, it's over. I about to say, like, that is mad weird he did that. So, GG, my dude. See ya. Man, I freaking love Deanne. Oh my god. Just guaranteeing one shots. All over the place. All right. So what do we have? Oh, this is a green small DN. Oh my God. He out CC me crazy. Uh, I think this is going to be a hard ale then. Cause this team just made some, some meme. This guy got a serious team going on. It's just that this team is going to last too long to face. How much he can stall me out. I usually just go bonk and just finish him off. Yeah, Kyo, he, he's usually the prime target for most people. Which actually is kind of good for me. Especially if he doesn't go for his buffs. Especially if he does go for his buffs on me. 
Um, I'm just gonna do this thing for now. And I guess do this. But I want to enforce a cleanse on himself. I want to see the cleanse. Because once he forces the cleanse, that allows me to, to have pretty much a nuking chance against this guy. That's why I didn't target Margaret right there. And my hand is kind of garbo. Yeah, my hand is pretty, pretty garbo garbage right now. He just go for his ultimate. Duh. What? I've never seen someone go for actually their ultimate on me. This is very surprising. Mm. I've never, I've never seen someone just rush the ultimate with Green Deanne. Holy. But okay. Well, let's see what happens then. Oh, I got a Deanne card. Which might be, which might be nice. Hmm. Let's see what happens though. Is he gonna go for my um Margaret? Okay, he's gonna get rid of Keo. That's a guarantee. Or he's gonna attack Margaret all the way. Yeah, you know you was gonna kill, sir. I don't know what's going on right now. <laughs> I am so confused. I am a I am for loss of words right now. Actually, I think I'm kind of like messed up right now because the ignites are gonna get removed first before her taunt. Yeah, the ignites are gonna get removed first before her taunts. Oh wait, does it? Okay. Oh wait, her taunt was first, wasn't it? Yeah, her taunts was first. What am I saying to myself? Like her taunts was legit first. Now, if he doesn't cleanse, he just gets nuked. Unless he gets rid of Keo. Yes, cleanse, cleanse, cleanse. Let's go. Let's see, buddy boy. Oh wait, he's gonna finally target Keo. I mean, even if you got buffed, so you still gonna nuke, get nuked. All right. I can tell you that one. I've seen plenty of Margaret players get nuked regardless. And now he wants to debuff. Oh my God. He should have debuffed a long time ago, especially since he LCC'd me. This is hilarious. Yeah, GG. He's gonna get nuked regardless. Hope he knew that. It's just all. Bro, Margaret players, they just don't know what to do when they see Deanne. Honestly, what do you do when you see Ragnarok Deanne? Well, you should kill her off first rather than Kyo, but what do you do? All right, I'm thinking I'm going to make this my last match since I'm tired of using um Margaret players. They just don't know what to do against me, unfortunately. Um, This time it's a red Gother. All right, very curious on this one. I guess it's gonna probably be an easier matchup as well. Since he's running red Gother. Um I'm gonna attack right here. Just so I make sure. Oh, he had evade food too. Cool. I just want to make sure his ignites are gone. And he's using red Gother, so that gives me an opportunity to um push for my ultimate even more. I just want to make sure he his buffs are the one that's fresh, so I can remove that instead. I usually just wait it out, but I felt like this would be a better option. All right, so he doesn't know my threat. Good. It's actually perfect for me. He went for Chandler, so he actually doesn't know that that um, Ragnarok DN is the true threat of my team, which is very good for me. I mean, Merlin also is very close to ultimate as well. But it's fine. Oh, wait. He can also petrify me right here, can't he? Hmm. Maybe I should have went for the cleanse. Because he can petrify me with Droll. Actually, wait, no. I have a cleanse. What am I talking about? What am I talking about, really? Like, you have a cleanse with Margaret, so you can nuke regardless. 
And then you can just stand up with him, Chandler, if you need to. Against that Lolly Merlin. And that should be GG. Finally. Woo. Yeah, Margaret players, they, they just don't know what to do. Honestly, I, I wouldn't know what to do either. If I seen this team in 4v4. Oh my god. Well, he was almost going to kill. Honestly, he was. He was going to kill. Um. Yeah. I guess we can do, just do this to him. He's already dead. Oh, it's not low enough. Oh, well. His lolly is going to still be alive. It needed to be under 40%. And he forfeits. Yep. All our wins just pretty much was like Deanne just nuking, the, nuking them the entire match, which I love. Man, she's just so busted in PvP. Man, I'm glad I 6 out of 6 her. Especially since she's one of my favorite waifus in the game. So, I mean, for you, all you little people who are preparing for Ragnarok Deanne, she is really, really good. Especially against nuke and Margaret players. Obviously, you can have those moments where you can get out CC by Margaret. Just because, you know, she is a low CC type of unit. But when she got that ultimate, um, like 6 out of 6 or a higher dupe, she can actually just wipe the feel from Margaret players, you know? Especially since she can remove buffs. Which, Margaret players, they love to spam them buffs. But again, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. Again, this is Merly, and I'm out. Peace.